Kendrick Lamar was announced as the halftime headliner for the 2025 Super Bowl. Some of the industry and along with Lil Wayne's supporters feel as though he was snubbed. Reason being is because Jay-Z and Rock Nation was responsible for curating the Super Bowl halftime show. Another reason is because the Super Bowl will take place in New Orleans. Lil Wayne was born in New Orleans. And in the beginning of this year, he said he was looking forward to oh, it. Is in New Orleans. Wayne, what, what you do to Super Bowl? <laughs> Duh. I want. I gotta ask. You got. I'm just. It's a question, Wayne. I know. I know the answer, but I gotta ask you. Of course, the Super Bowl is in New Orleans. Um, I think it's in 2025 or something like He's that. He's doing not, it. I'm not sure. Not. I'm not, I'm Wayne, not sure. Come on, man. Say I'm it, Wayne. Sure you shit. No, say I, it, no, Wayne. I don't. They know. I, I can. I will not lie to you. I am not have not got a call. Hey, Jay. <laughs> like but I'm that. on. I'm camera so, folk, Jay. But we all praying. You know, we praying, we keeping our fingers crossed. I'm working hard. I'm going to make sure this next album and everything I do is killer. So I'm going to make it very hard for them. to. I want to just make it hard for them not to. Not to pick. Regine, Lil Wayne's daughter, she spoke out and she believes it is envy. Over on Cam's and Mace podcast, they were upset with Jay-Z for selecting Kendrick over Lil Wayne. Mace even believes that Jay-Z is way too old to be hating still. Supporters are upset because Jay-Z and Lil Wayne was just seen with each other two weeks ago, laughing and smiling together while announcing that Kendrick Lamar will be headlining the 2025 Super Bowl. There was a little shade thrown at Drake. Drake supporters believe Jay-Z Jay-Z played a part in Shade and Drake. Lil Wayne's manager also spoke out. Confused, disappointed, angry, but most of all, inspired. We'll never again be in a position or have the GOAT in a position where we are at the mercy of someone else's decision. We will make the decision. Birdman also spoke out. Shaking my head. These niggas. Nikki, Drake, Lil Wayne, YMCMB. I'ma make these niggas respect us. Hate for real. Nikki then spoke up and spoke out and explained, according to herself, the real reason why Lil Wayne will not be headlining the 2025 Super Bowl. I love watching the whole industry play dumb time after time. The truth is the truth, no matter who tells it. Picking and choosing who y'all accept the truth from. Might tell a joke, but won't tell you a lie. Y'all know his next move is going to be to tell y'all a certain someone is being treated so unfairly so that y'all can go back into that trance. Go and enjoy your money before it's too late one n-word took a knee the other n-word took the bag he gonna get you in words in line every time got everything in the world still spiteful and evil disgusting be happy go be happy in the rap business in the women business when you got the politicians and the police you good though plus that ugly laffy taffy alien tried to tell y'all but y'all wanted brunch denying a young black man what he rightfully put into this game for no other reason but your ego your hatred for birdman drake and nikki got you punishing lil wayne lil wayne the goat nola was good eminem stood firm on having 50 cent come out a white man it's sad house 13 no loyalty well then will keep sunning you and by the way you don't know the half of what Lil Wayne has done for me and others Wayne had Drake and I on his tour with no papers signed he was on all of my mixtapes with no papers signed this man has literally changed the face of hip-hop the hair too if you know you know he inspired so many to tat their faces and get locks inspire your face to want to be a great MC he never was in this for money it's always been for the love of music